What's up is down, what's left is right Chasing stars and holding you I can't see the end, but we'll see it through In um, uh, Wedderburn and stayed in a little camp spot not far from there called Hard Hill. Now Hard Hill is free camping but you can also do a donation uh, to the community centre and get a key which will get you access to the toilets and showers which um, was a fantastic. So we stayed here, we were only going to stay overnight but we just loved this this area and uh, we ended up staying there about three nights. Um, fantastic campground, able to have campfires, plenty to see, plenty of walks. Um, if you like to do a little bit of detecting, this is the place you can do a little bit of detecting and um, yeah, and there's a lot, a lot of history around the what you see here is what you call a paddler and it was used to extract gold um, out of rock and so forth. Also there is a mine here but it's closed off and uh, yeah it's really really just a good area that you could just check out and have a wander. Now what you're looking at here was a working um, eucalyptus distillery. Um, where they extract the eucalyptus from the leaves. So there's a lot of uh, cooking pots, pr like a big pressure cooker. And yeah, and there's a detailed uh, description on what the, how it was all done and, and um, you know, and from there, I think it was uh, um, quite, quite an active um, uh, distillery. Um, it's no longer in use now, but it's great to... Uh, have a look at and as you can see the campgrounds I've got lovely seating area barbecues plenty plenty of cover that gets warm um, yeah we thoroughly enjoyed this uh, campground On the main street in Wedderburn, there's this general store that uh, was uh, built uh, in 1913, um, and it's a museum. So what happened was um, the owners um, sort of walked out and left it, and it's absolutely preserved, you know, preserved like a hundred-year-old general store, which looks the same as the day the owners walked out on. Um, it's uh, dated from 1913, but the business actually opened in 1840. So you can actually see some really, really old um, trinkets and uh, 
wire cheese slices, biscuit tins, meat safes, everything you could possibly think of. We spent hours in this store and uh, would you believe to to take a, a wander through is only five dollars but we chose for the eleven dollar option because we got a cup of tea and a scone and endless time in in this museum and uh, well worth it guys if you really want to eat go back in time this is the place uh, yeah what else can I say um, it's got a lot of horse and carriages um, out the back um, it's got cooking pots yeah well uh, you know I'll, I'll let you watch the video and you can see for yourself Yeah, could be. Yeah. Ice chest. So the ice was placed on top. So it would have been the same. A cool guardy said there's a um, fridge. And then that's the fridge part down there, kept it cool. So this was after the so this is the end of the vi video this week um, so if you like this video give it a like and if you want to see more content please subscribe thank you see you guys on the next one